So hi everyone and uh, we are esteemed to welcome the fame of uh, Kachi Sir, Ms. Samyukta Vishwanathan for our show. We welcome you ma'am. Thank you. How are you doing? How are you doing? Fine, I'm doing good. I guess that you have been uh, walking around the spine for mm -hmm. quite time. So what do you think about that? How was the infrastructure? How did students' creativity enhance the creativity? So I would like to hear from you. So first, I want to actually na soli than the buying room impressed our can because this is something that I seeing that's very different in um, especially specific to Indian to South the kind of educational institutions I have seen so far. Um, idu vande and the activities extracurricular activities vande chuma or a PT class illa or a chinnada or a or a club pote not giving much other bit you actually investing in. an activity center like this is i mean what i saw was um a swimming pool a fully functional gym a music studio a dance studio and uh, those are the basic ones there's there's a full cricket simulator like yes. that's really really cool there's an there's an arcade place like na padikkumode indha maadhiri irundhuchuna kandipa it's something that i know i would have been able to be more productive in fact because i'm also giving time for my brain to play so i'm super impressed by that the students were all um, lovely and i know in the madri in the madri activities la time invest panite obviously you don't just waste your time doing it also but taking the time to doing it, uh, to do it and also being productive in your other things will only make you better i was particularly impressed by the artwork that said yes, unlock your spine with yeah. all that is really really impressive i'm very happy seeing it okay. எப்படி வந்து ஆக்டிங்குள்ளே வரணும் அப்படிங்கிற அந்த இன்ஸ்பிரேஷன் ஒரு இன்ஸ்டியூஷன் இன்ட்யூஷன் வந்துட்டு உங்களுக்குள்ள வந்துச்சு ஹம் ஸோ ஐ திங்க் இட்ஸ் ஆல்மோஸ்ட் சம்திங் ஐ க்ரூ அப் ஐ டெஃபினி க்ரூ அப் இன் ஐ க்ரூ அப் வாட்சிங் மூவிஸ் ஐ க்ரூ அப் ரீடிங் புக்ஸ் அண்ட் என்னோட அப்பாவுக்கு ஆல்வேஸ் ஒரு ட்ரீம் என்னன்னா ஹி வாண்ட் பி என் ஆக்டர் ஆனால் அது இட் வாஸ் It was a proper pipe dream. I was like, I'm going to go to the pipe dream. Like, no one's going to, how to do this. You know, I'm very new to it. So, I was like, there was a little spark in my life. And um, I remember when I, I saw I first, the first movie I saw was Ale Payude. Okay. Which is, um, I know it's like a love story and a child. I was, I was young. And obviously, I didn't understand anything at that point. But as I grew up and I was watching Ale Payude, another movie, Ani and that made a really big role. Even I realized that you like these people on screen they're on screen they're not really in front of us but they can make you feel so many things now are the pretty onion cup pretty are the when they can make you feel all those things i was truly i was like i want to do this i was really inspired so um vikram sir i would actually attribute that to four people vikram sir madhavan sir Shalini ma'am and Mani Ratnam sir. These people are the ones who like really without ever talking to me just seeing their work I was like I want to do this. Uh, when you said Madhavan sir I clearly remember that on uh, your Instagram post you put Madhavan sir on a tweet. On your post. Yeah. So I would like to hear uh, that instant. Um, so I I have met Madhavan uh, actor Madhavan in in when I was like five years old I think you know Chinna uh, Vaisla I loved him I saw Alay Payude and I didn't remember I don't know much of it obviously I can't understand it but you know and the I could remember the song in the room for again that that frame is like severed in my memory so other park more than my um, I mean during that time my uncle was working at down under which is the bowling place in Chennai and he was coming the mother and um, so was coming there and so he mentioned my mom and I were like were like love crazy fans of him and his work yes. and so i he said you know you guys should come so we went super excited we went and i used to be a very as a 5 year old i was one little bit i used to go around thing only i think i became shy after 5 year old but apparently the first time i felt shy in my life was in front of mother okay. he just came and he lifted me up and carried him yeah. so the photo will have me sucking my thumb yeah yeah I've never done that apparently in my life before. In fact, I used to hate when other people do that. Ana, yenaki enna pannu nu theriyama like I was just completely enamored by 
uh, him for me, and he was so sweet. He was really nice to me. He spoke to me. I obviously don't remember everything that he said to me. I was very young. My mom told me, but he was just um, such brother. And thankfully, someone knew him later. Uh, someone knew him. Another uncle knew him, so he got the photo printed and signed and he put keep smiling so that's something that i hold very close to me when you were opening up to your parents that mm-hmm. acting is going to my career then how was their reaction i think their first reaction was they laughed okay. they really laughed and like, no, they acting blow like i was the person a wedding function kellam pona kodum book eduthu povan padikradhukku not because i like to study because i wanted to get like on for for smart i wanted to get that so they were shocked they laughed and i said i was serious and then they they were just so upset i'm pretty sure there was some crying in between uh, also and to this day my mom and dad joke that i emotionally blackmailed them into it which is not the truth maybe a little bit true but i said my thing was nothing else i do will make me happy it wasn't emotional blackmail it was fact yeah. nothing is nothing else i do will make me happy mm. this is the only thing i can do and um thankfully we go for career counseling and the career counselor was completely on my side and uh thing then my mo- got my mom on my side okay then and my grandmom my granddad on my side then we all work to get my dad on my side so now they are super supportive best parents i could ask for when you quoted uh, about studies i heard that uh, Hundred to ninety eight on that, you would feel very bad. Yes, actually, our cycle test, uh, cycle test la. Now, when the out of fifty, now forty nine, wangi te are the till for many years after that. In I put this six star, seven standard la. Okay. For many years after that, my friends made fun of me. Why they remember it? Even now, my classmates will remember that. it was just an obsession with uh, perfection it's a very unreal obsession it wasn't uh, it wasn't like i i know that doesn't make me smarter or less smarter it was just i have to be perfect okay then uh, we would like to know your future collaborations working with directors actors um i uh, future collaborations um nothing is confirmed i do have a web series coming up for hotstar yeah. soon so i'm excited about um that uh, very recently just two days back what i'm super excited about is i will be playing an important role in sural 2 on okay. amazon prime yeah i saw the video yes. yes so that is something i'm super excited it was a yeah. great uh, that team is is just magic to work with and um, i can't reveal anything about the story but i can promise you that it will be a great ride it will be a really good show for everyone and i also remember that after uh, watching kachi sir i thought that ivanga na ingeyo paathirken i was thinking like that and i was surfing through internet like uh, what all movies you have done so finally i found it oh mana penne la vandu and the original mana pen vandu neenga da abinte i finally found it out so yes. how was the experience in it? yes in that one i was uh, rich girl aditi i yes. remember that was my role adu vandu actually na us la irundha pona panna so us la irundha pona vandu visa renew pandradhukku thirupiyo vandha and um, through a friend of mine the associate director lutfuddin he got in touch with me and asked if i'd be interested in doing like a small role in the film in during that time yenak i had no idea of doing films in tamil because i was studying in new york i was doing theater there i was working jobs there and so i was like anga poita i have to settle and that's where my life is okay. So now I'm going to use a class that I want to do this it seems like it's an interesting peli chuplo of course was such a big hit and um, I really like that dialogue that she says about uh, business panona um so uh, business like, panona um inna vech to panadinga ninga business deal pannunga and she says something which is and it was about varadakshas about uh, dowry so those are things that I um mean a lot to me so even though it was like a almost uh, miss just a blink and a miss i was like oh, i want to do this it seems like a nice team to work with it was that was my first film experience and um it was a very very fun easy interesting experience and yeah i'm glad it started recently a movie came chari triple 1 yes 
so your experience with working with murli sharma sir, sir and ned kishore sir uh, both of them are just wonderful human beings um, very different people but both absolutely amazing in their own way both extremely talented and murli sharma sir so committed to his work i he fully gets into the character that sometimes i'm like i don't know if you're talking to me as the character or the person um and uh, he i was a little nervous because there's these senior people murli sharma sir like talked to me asked me about my life and all of that stuff and he was really sweet gave good advice kishor sir i did spend more time with um he's really funny very intelligent um and it was easy to work with him because you make jokes and he's so good with improv he makes things funnier so i'm just glad that i got the opportunity to work with such experienced people and i also remember that the very first telugu film i watched of uh, murli sharma sir was uh, ala vaikuntha puram mm-hmm. so the role he played was like uh, he nailed it the role yeah so uh, keeping the lips up till the entire film and uh, uh, his leg got some disorder so he was acting like a real character so i was very much impressed by it uh, he he is he really get if you see this film completely different character completely different it's so interesting to see how a person really gets into it and commits to it fully sure and uh, now we have a rapid fire round okay okay so your most favorite actor vikram sir vikram your favorite go to song right now it's unakda on from chitta and for getting some vibe to get out of for getting some vibe um to get <laughs> <laughs> I would really want so tempted to say Kachi Sera but let me let me not do that let me say um something else uh I think it's um, this is going to sound very weird could there's this uh, telugu song Uchi from Kachi Mata Vetti okay fine <laughs> yeah and your favorite destination favorite destination I think it would be New York um, somewhere you haven't been I want to go to um Manchester specifically because my sister just got married and moved there I've okay. never been there I would like to go there a journal to act very favorite genre to act uh i think my favorite genre would be action action based yeah. a favorite line from a script you have worked on i think i haven't worked with um, worked as much to say that i did one short film called i hate you i yeah, love you follow in that there's one line that i really like uh, um anju varsham patti enna pesa 50 varsham analo and nambikai apdiye da irukku so i really like and uh, i also i'm also a big fan of uh, shots of harmony so oh, yeah, i've yes, seen it yeah, oh, i've so seen great. it and especially for the toothbrush shot or random sharing i have like it is and so it was really fun and and the 30 okay. seconds la vanti i feel some fun expressions so it was really nice i was watching Thank on repeat you. mode really yeah. i will tell them they're so happy i'll tell them to also pick it up again then to oh. start again yeah. pre shoot routines pre shoot routine of course like if i go super officially my face routine is one whole thing ice the face put the moisturizer put the sunscreen all of that stuff but as an actor my pre shoot routine is to go through the lines i have a, i'll always have a highlighter pencil and pen highlight oh. everything that's important i need the lines to be inside like internal before i see it you know anga poi the lines ala marundichna appla da it's yes. it's a terrible thing so that's a very important uh, thing for me and it's very important for me to be um, in my space when i what i mean in that is i'll be with especially if we're doing an ensemble shoot absolutely love hanging out with everybody but i try to be in the space of the set itself in the space of the film not put my mind onto thoughts outside the funniest bloopers on set funniest bloopers on set ah uh, there's been actually a lot of uh, things that have happened but i'll tell you what <laughs> what's most funny is probably i have fallen multiple times on sets with absolutely i it won't even not even during my action sequence chumma out of nowhere i will fall but i'll always get back up and be like i'm i'm here i'm here so for everybody else it's a little scary in the beginning but it's pretty funny i fall a lot i'm sure you can easily they can make a compilation of it if someone's watching and if you weren't an actress mm. what would be the other path which you have pursued i think i would be um a, either a teacher or a writer or both a teacher slash writer yeah one piece of best advice that you have received in your life would be that whatever is meant for you will find you 
there is no way it's going to go away from you and it's something my mom repeats to me over and over and over again and she's told me she said whenever you're feeling low as that just ask me i will say it 10 100 times to you over and over if you need it because i want you to know that and the one best piece of advice that you would like to give uh, for the aspiring actors i think the best advice i can give for aspiring actors is to is to just um keep trying it's easy to say but i'm saying it after trying for like what i've been trying for so many years like it properly yes, yes. literally uh, since i was much younger and i'm still young <laughs> director shouldn't see that and be like oh okay amma role ko potla so um but i've been trying for a long long time and it does happen but it takes a lot you'll feel like giving up in between uh, but if this is your calling don't give up it'll come to you yeah okay, come to the end of rapid fire awesome. and the mm-hmm. final question is uh as i already said you have been for a decade in the cine industry yes. so how do you feel before and after kachi sir okay so i think it's um before it was very different now when the valley lalam pomode photos ella edka matang maybe one or two would have seen me somewhere and even that is ninga sonningle engiyo paatha maari and maadri it will be okay. a couple of them will recognize me but now it's the recognition is so much that i'm i'm a little overwhelmed by it because i feel like um it's very it's like i've been waiting for this but now i'm like i have to be even more careful about what i'm doing the kind of work i'm putting in i can't just drop be like ah so i'm all this there's now is when it starts really um and it's it's like the light at the it, it is kachi sera was literally the light at the end of the tunnel for me because i was just going getting rejected again there were projects but recognition mm. was not coming so it's changed a lot and i think i'm going to truly count my time in the industry as um when i started after covid which means it's been about 3 years three now 3 years yeah so i think this is the beginning and uh, we are extremely pleased to thank you for your valuable time thank you so much for uh, spending with us so uh, that's the end of the session thank you ragu you did really really well thank you congratulations <laughs> thank you what a what